The John Howard Association has always been based on the principle that no closed system should be left to police itself. Carceral spaces are very opaque. You can't see inside, even though people from the communities go inside, and then we lose track. We don't know what's going on in there. And the John Howard Association, they've been a stalwart in causing uh, juvenile justice and criminal justice reforms in the state of Illinois that's brought us out of sort of the dark ages and has started to head us toward um, more informed, more research-based and evidence-based practices that make everybody safer. What makes us really different is that we spend a lot of time going into prisons. Um, that part of our mission, that part of our mandate is to be inside the prison so that we can see for ourselves. We spend a lot of time learning about things that people outside of prison don't know about because we understand that unless we know that, um, we can't really be on the front lines of change. Prison is really a highly stressful place due to the isolation. Uh, when you don't have an organization uh, to be a watchdog group over a prison, it's like leaving the wolf in charge of the hen house, right? The way they lift our morale is following up with us and interacting with us, and therefore we can pass word to our guys who are also struggling with issues and say, well, look, this organization actually worked. They helped me through this process. So that goes a big way. We come in, and we keep coming in and we listen to people when they talk, and we hear their concerns, and we respond to those concerns. And it is those concerns, it is those issues that fuel our day-to-day -day work. I mean, it is, it, it's the transparency, it's the shining the light that brings the hope.